I'm sitting here in front of my phone and uh, it says your order has been placed for buying stock. So I'm back in the stock market. I figured that if I'm telling other people, um, we should get back in the stock market. I, I was thinking about it before I said that um, we should wait a month to get back in the stock market or that I should wait a month um, with my less money than a lot of people have. But um, I feel like what happened is today a lot of people lined up their shorts and that means they borrowed money and that inf to buy stock and that inflated the price of all this stock and they're assuming that it's going to go down and um, I like kicking shorts asses. So um, I, I said a long time ago I don't believe in shorts and so uh, I, I don't believe in shorting at all. Um, it's just not my philosophy. Like I, I think you should find someone that you should bet on. So... Um, I bet on AMD, Advanced Micro Devices. Um, they've been killing it for a long time, and I watched them. I watched them go up, and I was like, "This can't continue forever." And then um, I never invested in them, and then I, I was always kicking myself about it. And then um, it dropped twenty dollars per share, and I was like, "All right, maybe it's like a decent buy right now." Um, like, but. I don't know. It's hard not to buy NVIDIA. Um, I actually was going to buy Splunk. That was my initial reaction. I didn't have enough money for a single share. <laughs> I only have 100 bucks. So I was like, I can get two shares. I almost bought Snapchat, and then I was like, eh, I'm not even on Snapchat right now, but I probably will get back on Snapchat. And I, and I do think Snapchat's actually at a, at a pretty good price right now, um, but I don't trust your revenue model. Um, with AMD, I Maybe I shouldn't trust their revenue model as much either, um, but for some for some reason, at least I feel like they have something physical. Um, yeah, so if you guys want to be patriotic, it's probably uh, like it would probably be good to be in the stock market right now. Yeah, I do understand. Like I, I listed off reasons to be worried about the stock market, but when I list off the hotel industry, um, you have to also listen to Trump who's saying that he wants to give a stimulus to the hotel industry and has it. And that's not because of his, um, cause he's in the hotel industry. It's because he's trying to protect the real estate market. And, um, when he's talking about cutting payroll taxes, that's like, do you realize what that does for a company like Amazon? It's, it doesn't do as much for a company like Google, but, um, it does do a lot for someone like Amazon, who's a who, who's a very worker heavy country company. Um, Walmart, it's like a massive deal to cut their payroll tax um, because they employ so many people. And um, you also have to consider that anytime that you have a company that has um, physical logistics, like these these are the companies that we really have to protect right now. Uh, like like Amazon, Walmart, grocery stores. Like, um, because we don't want to have what happened in China happen here where they've had a 132% increase in the price of pork. Um, and they're a very pork hungry country. They, they like pork is like very central to the Chinese diet. Uh, it's kind of like rice. Um, so it's kind of like soy, um, is actually a pretty big part of their diet and we sell them a lot of soy, um, um, a, a lot of Asian countries eat, eat a lot of pork. And so we don't want um, the price of our food to get completely screwed. Um, so that's why, um, like, that's, that, that, like, that's why the decrease in the payroll tax is such a big deal. Um, all right. So, yeah, I bought stock. I guess everyone else should buy stock. I'm not showing you my paintings today. It's because I'm painting big stuff. It's taking forever and it's hard. Like I, 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 I've started to realize it, that I, I, it's like the most audacious thing in the world. I'm just going to paint, uh, um, a, a four foot by four foot painting. I'm going to paint four of them. <laughs> like, where are you going to put them? I have, I have like one place in my entire house that I can fit one of them. <laughs> so, but I'm going to paint four of them and then I'm going to paint even bigger ones. I'm going to paint one that's five foot two. And <laughs> geez, like, what am I going to do with these giant paintings? And it's going to cost so much for the paint. And then I realized I have to just have fun because I'm trying to be the best artist of all time. And I think I just have to, um, enjoy myself to be the best artist of all time. Because if, if you're, if you're not enjoying yourself making art, then you're not going to 
And that's why I did the three boob dog. But then now I'm like, what am I going to do with the three boob dog? How am I going to ever sell a three boob dog? There's no way to sell a three boob dog. Okay. So yeah, I'm back to cubism. All right. Um, let's all get in the stock market tomorrow. Because I, I have a feeling that because all those, because it went so much, so up today, um, it feels like it's about to drop a lot tomorrow, but that's why it's so scary. Coming, Hey everyone, I'm backing the stock market now. I think it's going to be okay if you, if you put money in right now, because I, I just put money in into AMD and I, I feel like that's a, that's been a, that it's still a risky bet. Like I'm not saying do not bet like me. I have a hundred bucks. So I, I, I started off with less. I, I used to own Ford stock. This started off with Ford stock back in 2008. <laughs> Seriously. I owned, I owned, I owned like $150 in Ford stock. No, I think I own like a hundred dollars in Ford stock, and now like I I I, I shouldn't have owned Ford. That <laughs> you should you should. That's why I'm kind of scared of AMD because of the logistics of manufacturing um, processors, but and and stuff like that. But anyway, so let's get in.